Okay, so um, the first thing that you want to do is you want to open go open up Google Earth. So find it wherever wherever it is, wherever you've downloaded it. Okay, any of these prompts that come up, you can just close them. So close this one. And that. Um, you have to make sure that you're connected to the internet, otherwise it just won't work. So you go to file, open. Um, now you need to find out where you've actually saved um, the GPX file that we sent you. So, we're online. Okay, mine are on my hard drive, so let's take a look. Yeah. Okay, right, some of you are saying that you're not actually seeing anything because it's a GPX file. So what you need to do here are your file types. You need to change that to GPX here. Or even if you change it to all files, it would have still worked as well. So change it to GPX file. Now all the files will show up. So click any file. You can click multiple files. So if you want to show um, both of your files, you, uh, your day one and your day two, you can just uh, open them both up. Okay, well, and that's it. It does the rest of the work for you. Right, so that was day one, I think. If you now want to open up, D2, you can do it on the same, um, you can do it at the same time, if not, you can do them separately. Right, there you go. Okay, now just zoom in and just play around if there's one particular point that you want to see, maybe find where your checkpoints are. So, um, let's take a look at Whitley Reservoir, so just zoom into your Whitley Reservoir. Okay, so I'm not going to go through how to use Google Earth, it's pretty much the same as Google Maps, but this is how you open it. Okay, so again, file, open, change your file types to GPX, and just select whichever file that is. Okay. 